Hello, my name is Johannes. I'm working in the product marketing here at Lemken. I'm responsible for the sea drills and power harrows. And this is the reason why I want to show you our Zirken EMR XMR power harrow in combination with a Solitaire MR mounted uh, cedar. Here we are standing right in front of our Zirken. In this case, we have a Zirken XMR. X means that it's a high performance a power harrow for more horsepower requirement. And we have the EMR, this is the power harrow for smaller tractors. The maximum horsepower requirement is 240 horsepowers for the Zirken XMR. Yeah, some uh, facts about our Zirken uh, power harrows. We are working with uh, four rotors per meter working width. That means that we have uh, 12 rotors on a three meter version. That means that we have very good crumbling in the soil, even in heavy soil conditions. Yeah, we put a lot of sorts in our uh, arrangement of the rotor and tines that we have a very good uh, movement of the soil through our power harrow tines. Next, a very important topic is that we have a welded gearbox. That means that we don't have any screws and bolts on our gearbox. That is uh, the reason that we have a very, very uh, smooth running of our power harrows, even in heavy conditions. It makes it more reliable for the farmers. We, we don't have any movement in bolted parts. And this is the reason why we are in the opinion that we are the best with our welded gearbox. Yeah, let's talk about the news of our new power harrow generation. We have a brand new wheel mark eradicators uh, with a higher yeah, overload energy, that means that we can work with that in even in heavier conditions. We have a new uh, yeah, marker system with uh, hydraulic cylinders on top. That means that we don't have any effects, for example, if stones hitting the, the marker because the cylinder is on top and we don't get any leakages there. Then we have the option that we have this disc to uh, make a smooth overlay. The new point is that we can have all three options on one machine that we can have a very perfect seat bed afterwards. If we are talking about comfort in uh, setting our power harrows, we have also some uh, very important information for you. Now it's possible on both generations, on the EMR and on the XMR, that we can have a hydraulic setting of the working depth and hydraulic setting of the leveling bar in between the power harrow. That means if you have heavy conditions, for example, you can set hydraulic very comfortable from the tractor cabin. You can set the, the leveling bar more down so that you have a more aggressive uh, yeah, working result. And if, you have, uh, if you're working in lighter soil, you can move it a little bit up that you get, have a very good soil movement through the power harrow. And the same if we are talking about the, the working depth, now it's possible or even on the smaller version that you can have the hydraulic uh, working depth. If you want to work deeper on some parts of the field, you can do this very comfortable from the tractor cabin. Maybe some of you have seen that we have a new uh, connection between the seat hopper and the power harrow or the cedar and the power harrow. Now the, the seat hopper is uh, carried on our roller. That has uh, two benefits. The first benefit is that we can transfer more weight from the seat hopper to our roller. And that means that we can have more reconsolidation effect because we have more weight on our roller. And the second uh, benefit is that we can set the working depth of the power harrow in a separate way as a seeding depth. For example, if you are going into the field and you want to work uh, deeper with your power harrow and you make the hydraulic setting deeper, it's not necessary to uh, control the working depth or the seeding depth of the cedar because both uh, depths don't have any effect on each other. So that is uh, also a very good and comfortable point on our Zircon Solitaire MR combination. We have also some news about our rollers. Rollers are very important on a power harrow. We are working with our Trapezi Packer rollers with 540 millimeters and with uh, 600 millimeters. And uh, now it's possible to have the 600 meter, millimeter version even on the smaller power harrow on the EMR. And of course, it's also possible to have a three point linkage on our power harrow 
for, uh, for example, to carry a, a precision planter or another machine from another manufacturer, for example. But now let's talk about the Solitaire MR. Let's start with the seat hopper. We have two versions of our seat hopper. We have the version uh, with 1,500 liters hopper capacity, and we have the bigger version uh, with 2,000 liters capacity. It's also possible to have this uh, yeah, 2,000 liter hopper as a divided hopper with a 60-40 with a split, for example, to, uh, to transport fertilizer and seed or two types of uh, seeds. For example, if you are, want to seed legumes and, uh, and rapeseed, uh, then you can have a calibration for both uh, seeds and you have an optimal dosing of both seeds for the optimal uh, yeah, spreading of the seeds. And what's also new on our hopper concept on the Solitaire MR is that we can have a third hopper, our multi-hub. It's a special yeah, hopper with, an, with its own dosing unit to, to dose uh, microgranulate or smaller seeds like grass, for example. And this hopper is, uh, yeah, is carried on the back of the machine and uh, you can have the, the seeds into the, uh, into the seed bar and of the OptiDisc system, or you can have the seed placement about the harrow with a special uh, buffle plate. The control of the multi is fully integrated in the software of the Solitaire MR. That means that we have our new software, the IQ Blue Drill, on our Solitaire MR, and the multi is fully integrated, so you have just one overview, and you can control all three parts or all three hoppers of our seed combination. The Solitaire MR is every time delivered in an isobar system so that you can use uh, your own tractor terminal or our well-known CCI terminals uh, to control our seed drill. Let's talk about our new dosing unit. This dosing unit is uh, also mounted, for example, on Solitaire DT, Solitaire ST, and also on our new front hopper Solitaire F. Here we have our new model dosing unit. We have some benefits about this uh, dosing unit. Yeah, in general, it is a system of uh, a seat wheel and a bottom flap. That means uh, it is uh, very similar to our old version. Every dosing unit is uh, separately uh, driven by an electric uh, engine. And uh, yeah, so that you can steer every dosing unit by, by own. And that makes it possible to have a manual section control from the tractor cab. That means you can have a half a shut off of the machine uh, just by clicking in the terminal and then the dosing unit isn't working anymore. It's also possible, of course, uh, to uh, do it automatically via GPS and section control. We have some more benefits uh, about this dosing unit. It is 100% uh, uh, fertilizer resistant because of uh, plastic and iron steel then uh, we can have a tourless change of our uh, seat wheels even if the, the seat hopper is uh, filled. If you choose the, the configuration with a double hopper, then you will have uh, four dosing units with four engines. This is a version with, uh, with uh, one hopper, so you have one dosing unit per half of the machine. And if you have the uh, double hopper, you will have uh, two dosing units on each side of the machine. But I will talk about that later. Very important topic on a seed drill is the calibration test. You can make the, the calibration test uh, fully from one side of the machine. You can do everything on the left side of the machine. That means you can, uh, you can change uh, the, f the flow of the seeds in the calibration tray. Then, of course, you can change the, the dosing units and you can start and stop the calibration mode in, uh, in four different options. First option is uh, yeah, the, general, the general start and stop in the tractor cabin over the, over the terminal and the software. Then you can have the option with this uh, small button that you can start and stop the calibration. You give, you give the, all the numbers in the tractor cabin in the terminal, and then you can start and stop the calibration test and the pre-dosing here. The third option is that you can have a, a small terminal right here. If they, you can start and stop the calibration test, you can, uh, you can uh, shut on the light or shut off the light. And the, the fourth option is that you can have an app on your smart device to, uh, to fulfill the full uh, calibration test on your smartphone, very comfortable without uh, climbing up and down the tractor cabin. And that's, this is very easy to handle. But now 
I want to show you how you can do this. You can uh, put the scale here at this part of the stairs. Then you can do all the settings for the calibration. Hang it here. Put the numbers and the weight of the calibrated seat uh, in the terminal or in your app. And then you're done with the calibration. After the dosing unit, we have to take care about the distribution of our seats. And this is the reason why we have our OptiDisc distributor head. The distributor has, has some uh, very important topics, very well known for Lemkin. We have a symmetrical arrangement of the outlets in the distributor head. That means uh, even if we are working a tram line mechanism, we can have, uh, yeah, we can have a very equal and uh, good distribution about the whole working width. And if we are talking about our tram line mechanism, we have two uh, rings inside this distributor head and they are going up and down to uh, shut off and shut on the, the tram line. That means uh, we can have, uh, yeah, we can shut off two to five la uh, rows if we want to have a tram line. That means you can go with uh, big uh, slurry tanks uh, in these tram lines or with small wheels for the sprayer, for example. And even if we are working with a tram line, we have a symmetrical arrangement of the outlets that we have uh, a very good distribution when we uh, are working in tram lines. Another point is that we have uh, big hoses to transport all the seats after the distributor to the seat disc. Here we can have different types of uh, control mechanism for our uh, distributor heads. That means we have the version that we only control the seat flow in the distributor. We can have the control of the tram line mechanism and the distributor and we can have a full controlled yeah, mode, that means that we have on every uh, seat tube, we have a, a sensor to control the seat flow. It's very important for Lemken that we have uh, the distributor head right on top of our seating bar. That means that we have short ways between the distributor head and the seating bar with the same pressure in the hoses. Uh, and the reason for this is also that we want to have a very equal and uh, precise uh, seat distribution about the whole working width. After the distributor heads, we have to talk about the uh, seating bar. I've mentioned uh, comfort uh, often, very often in this video and we have another point that is very comfortable at the seating bar and that is that we can do the setting of the, the seating depth also from the left side of the machine with this, uh, with this tool here. You have a, a lot of numbers where you can see how deep you are seating right now. And this is also a new topic on our Solitar MR. Maybe you know about our OptiDisc seating bar. We have two versions. We have the OptiDisc M. This is the seat bar that we have here at this uh, machine. We have a mechanical uh, pressure system. You can uh, set up to uh, 45 kilogram. And uh, we have the hydraulic version, the OptiDisc H. There you can have uh, the, the setting of the pressure in a very comfortable way out of the tractor cabin about a hydraulic system up to uh, 70 kilos and uh, if you want to change the seating pressure at this machine you can do this with a with a with a tool at this uh, bolt here um, also very important to know is the arrangement of our uh, seating disc we have a parallelogram guided uh, double disc calter in a, with row distances of uh, 12 and a half and 50 centimeters a very, a very important topic in our Lemkin philosophy is uh, that we have, most of the times we have a combination of uh, a TPV roller, trapezi packer roller and the double disc calter bar. That means in front of every double disc calter is a ring of the trapezi packer roller for optimum reconsolidation in the area where we want to place our seats later on. And this is uh, one of the most important reasons in combination with a parallelogram guided uh, double disc calter with the steering wheel that we have very equal and uh, very good and precise field emergencies after the seating process. Thank you for watching our video about the Zirkin EMR XMR and the Solitaire MR. I hope I could give you some more information about our seat drill and power harrow. If you have uh, some more questions feel free to ask us in our social media channels. Uh, send us a mail or contact your Lemkin dealer in your area.